guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks very much for joining us again today. Got a very short video tutorial that'll show you how to install Google Analytics on Weebly. Uh, just before I do so, there's a link in the description down below that'll take you through to a free trial version of Weebly. So if you haven't tried it yet, or if you need a free trial version for any reason, click the link below and it is yours. So as you can see, I'm into my Google Analytics account. I am on the admin page, uh, which you click in the bottom left-hand corner and you select admin. And then I've gone uh, to the property. So basically the, the site that I've, you know, that I want to install the uh, analytics for. If you haven't created a uh, property in your Google Analytics yet, you'll need to do so. Um, however, I'm going to presume that you've got that kind of up and running yet. You know, that you've, you've created that at this point. It's in data streams um, in that menu. Um, so, you know, you could sort of easily add another one. I'll take you through the process very quickly. It's for web, obviously, because we are creating a website. Um, and then as you go, yeah. You you'd only need to do um, is enter the, the URL for that site if i do so for my little site and then i need to name that data stream um just call it test and then as you can see you can just create it at that point this is the page that appears when you first create that stream and as you can see if you go to install manually you can then copy this tag code so you make sure you hit that little um symbol in the top right hand corner of the box there and then once you've got that, you can also access it for a pre-existing stream if you click on it and hit view tag instructions in the top right hand corner. Um, you can also get to it there as well at the bottom, I imagine. So, and uh, once you've got that code, you need to head to Weebly and that code needs to exist in the footer for your website. So if you click settings and then go to SEO, um, the footer code section is right there. So give it a click and then a right click and then paste that code in, hit save. And then once you hit publish, that would have installed it on your website. And that concludes the video tutorial. So like I said, there's a free trial version of Weebly down below in a link in the description. So you can give that a click if you'd like to give it a go. If you haven't done so already, if you've enjoyed the video and you wanna see more content of this nature, give us a like and subscribe to the channel. If you've got any questions or queries, you can leave them as comments down below as well. Thank you very much.